for us with this? Well, what was it like to be back in Italy and to get a chance to play, but also to kind of be tour guide to the, the team? Oh yeah, it was it was pretty good, you know. Um, I used to live in Italy, so it was kind of like going home. So it was a good experience. We spent a good time with the team, and yeah. What was your favorite part of the trip? Um, my favorite part of the team, of the trip, um, maybe the food again. Yeah, <laughs> getting back to eat pasta and stuff, so it was pretty good. Everybody we've talked to, I'm sorry, we went on a trip talking about the bonding experience between you guys. From your standpoint, kind of what stood out about that and why and how different ways you guys are, are closer now than y'all were before? It was a good experience for the whole team. I think we grow, you know, as a team. Uh, we get to see um, everybody playing, you know. So get to learn people, get to know your teammates, uh, who you're going to spend the, the whole year with, you know. So it was a good experience for the whole team. What was the biggest selling point to you about why you wanted to come to Georgia? Um, I already answered that question before. Uh, yeah, you know, it's a, this conference first, it's, it's a big conference, you know, and ACC, like I told you before, uh, when I got a call from Mike White, it was different. So since that day, I said, why not? So I want to take this chance to come here and play with you. Since you've uh, since you've been here a while now, what what would you say are like the chief differences of where you're coming from, South Florida, right, uh, to to what you experience on a day to day basis, athletically, academically, you know, uh, all that. Yeah, I think yeah, we um, we're lucky to have you know all the people around us, you know, taking care of us. We have we have everything we need, so there's no excuse to get better every day. There's more of all that than you experienced where you were before? Uh, eventually, yes. Yeah. Eventually. We talked to Dylan uh, a few minutes ago. Just what have you seen from him as a freshman getting ready for his first season? Um, yeah, for Dylan, um, he's, he'd be having a good day of practice and he'd be putting everything together, you know, working hard. He's there every day uh, in the morning, walk out and stuff. So he, he getting himself ready. How have things gotten more intense since since you got into you're getting closer to the season? Are things getting more intense in practice and preparation? Yes, obviously uh, we started official practice last week, and this is week two, I think. Yeah, and so yeah, it's more intense. We're playing more. Um, coach putting ourselves in a um, situation where we need to you know learn each other. So I think it's going to help us a lot. Is that is what Georgia's doing radically different from what you're doing for? Is there a lot of learning for you on the court basketball wise? Uh, you know, it's a different situation. It's a different uh, play style. You know, and eventually it's different. Yeah. What do you feel like is the biggest adjustment you've had to make so far, as far as that play style? Uh, I think the defense, the drop defense. So that's going to be my first time playing the drop defense and the uh, the way I'm doing that right now is I kind of like it so I think I'm going to get I hope I'm getting more better uh, before the season comes. What sort of ways do you feel like you've been preparing for the physicality that you know, playing in the SEC is going to be like this year? Uh, I've been told that I am the biggest guy in the SEC so I'm not sure yet so I'm going to see <laughs> but I'm ready for any you know yeah. Do you have a message for other players who are going to be going against you for the first time? Can we talk about that physicality? What what can they expect from you when you're? Oh yeah, I'm going. I'm going to go. I'm I'm coming. <laughs> you're coming. We coming. What, what NBA big guy would you liken yourself to? Is there an NBA player that style you try to emulate there in the paint? Um, I mean, dominance wise, you know, I would say Jordan B. You know, because. We came from the same country, he from Cameroon, and big guy, MVP, right, last year. So, I would say Jordan B, I hope, you know. Any other questions for Russ? Russell, I heard that Coach White's been talking to you guys, or I did at one point about the NCAA tournament, you know, what it would take maybe to get there. Um, you know, do you know what that looks like? Like, what does this team need to do to get to that level, you think? Um, right now, we just been focused on winning the day. Mm -hmm. You know, wake up, go to class, eat, get ready for workout, go to practice, go treatment after. 
do your homework, wake up the day after, do it again. So we just focus about winning the everyday, getting close to, to the season. What have you learned 